special summon. Wow, this hand is like butt tastic. Uh, we'll just draw a card. Activate another upstart goblin. Draw a card. Uh, we have the Monarch Stormforth. I'm just going to summon this and pass. <laughs> Hopefully, Sega Chris, I was just looking for you, bro. That that's that, I was I was just looking for you. Okay, Sega Chris, what is your name on Dueling Network? So after this match, we can play. Do I run Lucid Turn and TG Stun? I don't, but if I... I guess actually I should, to be honest. I think when I built this deck, cross, uh, Crossroads wasn't legal on Dueling Network. Or at least it, they didn't have it. No, they may have. But I think... I think I might need to, because it would have stopped some of the stuff in that last duel, like when he dropped Ragnazir on me. Uh, it would have came out. No, he still would have drawn a card. It would have been in defense mode, though. He wouldn't have maybe gotten two draws. But it is Sega Chris 5. Okay. Oh, my God. Jerry Beans. <laughs> what is this? Is this dude trolling? All right. Well, uh, I get to draw a card. So um, we'll take the 1650. And we will draw a card. I was kind of surprised that that actually worked. We got Monarch Stormforth and Soul Exchange. Hopefully he sets some back row. Because if not, my Mobius just isn't going to do much. Sweet. He set two cards. Activates Magic Planner. What? Hold on, though. You guys send a continuous trap to the graveyard. <laughs> Hold on. What, what, what are you doing, Discord 1996? I know. Jerry Bean's hype. Okay. He, no. Why? <laughs> don't do that <laughs> now i know what the hell you have <laughs> all right whatever we'll attribute this with soul exchange and let's see what you got i know it's too early in the morning dude it's wait it's 12 it's 12 45 eastern standard time all right we'll summon that mobius and we'll go after those two cards oh uh, or, or we'll just get nothing okay he's got the phoenix chain oh he's gonna use that with magic planner okay that's fine He'll probably use that with the magic planter then. And that's exactly what he does. Okay. <laughs> He's like, it's all good. Chicken Beans Man OTK. No, Chicken Beans Man FTK. Activates an upstart goblin. Uh, two upstart goblins. I think that's the way I opened this duel too, right? With double upstarts? Yeah, that's exactly what I did. Jerry, uh, Jerry drops his beans in your mom's mouth. But well, that's not very nice. You know what? At least I can attack with Mobius now. He gave up his Phoenix Chain for more cards, which means I can attack now. I think I'm going to set my Rodent Totem because if it dies, it's like not an issue. I can bring it back from, um, I think, the the Poison Draw Frog. Yeah, I can I can bring it back from Poison Draw Frog. So he's just going to set. Uh, we got a Duke Frog Sighting. Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be a little aggressive here, guys. Let's, let's see if, exactly what we can get away with. <laughs> I'm going to go into this. I'm going to go into Gachi Gachi. See if we can power up our uh, our Mobius and Gachi Gachi will be resistant to Mirror Force at the same time. Okay. Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean with the W2H? What are you talking about? This is a, this is a total legal play. Call the Haunted on what? On Call the Haunted on Jerry Beans, man. Okay. I'll just attack it with Mobius. Yeah, I'll just attack it with Mobius then. Fair enough. Uh, that was kind of a weird. It's kind of a weird call of the haunted, to be honest. Maybe I could have done like a no. Nah, that that wouldn't have been worth it. Doing like a um, uh, an enemy controller play or something like that. I have a unique deck, but for some reason, it has a yellow band sign. Is it on Dueling Network? Because I I have no idea what to tell you. Uh, I wish I, I really do wish that I had a Denko Seka. If I did, I I probably would win this duel. Activates Reckless Greed. What is what is he trying to get to? Like, I, I don't even understand. Discord didn't gain from the upstarts. Did he not? Hold on. Uh, yeah, I don't think he did. Um, I'm telling him right now to gain 2,000 life points. Because I did, yeah, I did open up uh, double upstarts. And he didn't, he didn't actually gain any life points. So, he needs to gain those. <clears throat> it's fine. I just told him. So, it's all Gucci now, guys. He has a lot of cards, but I still don't really understand what his, like, what is what, what is his win condition right now? You know what I mean? Like, he's trying to do something. I just, I don't know what the heck it is. He's trying to get to more Jerry Beans, man. I mean, okay, I, I kind of get that, but, like, 
What is that? What is that? Tell me what that does. I just want to know what the heck that does. If he's just trying to get to like more Jerry Beans, man. He's cheating. He's running. Hope for escape. He wants to get his life points lower. That could be that could be an option. If he's running like hope for escape and he wants to draw a bunch of cards, he activates another card to hunt it on Jerry Beans, man. Okay, where is this going? Tributes for a set card. So is that like Shadow Dragon or something? Uh, I'm a little. I'm gonna summon this. I'm gonna summon my Swap Frog because I do need to get a Treeborn Frog in the graveyard. I mean, you you kind of always want a Treeborn Frog in the graveyard if it's Frog Monarchs. I'm gonna bounce this to my hand first because I don't want to lose out. Actually, I probably should have bounced Mobius, right? Yeah, I think I should have bounced Mobius. <clears throat> I still can, I believe. I could special summon it. Let's find out what he has. Okay, a, a Trent? Dude, is he trolling me? Seriously? All right, well, I guess I'll take 900. I think this guy is like half trolling me. We'll attack with Mobius. Tribute setting for Shed All Drag. No, not Shed All Drag. I meant Shed All Beast. Shut up. I meant Shed All Beast, guys. Chill out. I meant Shed All Beast. All right. He was going to be locked on under Reckless, but he activates another Reckless Greed to draw two more cards. I mean, hey, Trent, Trent might end up being the next meta, guys. You don't know. Seriously. You never know. Trent could end up being the next meta. I mean, I, I don't think it's that good of a card, but personally, it could it could end up being good. You know what I mean? Play Necroz. Okay, he plays Miracle Fertilizer to target Trent. Uh, okay. Go on. <laughs> well, Infernal Reckless Summon <laughs> with two Trents. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. This is a new one. He's probably wait, wait. Somebody's saying that. Somebody say that he's trolling, man. <laughs> <laughs> He's trolling with Trent deck. All right, so he has three Trents out. Fair enough. Why is he clicking my Mobius? Uh, n wait. What? I get to summon Mobiuses? I don't think that I have any more Mobiuses. I think I only run one. Yeah, I only run one. Yeah, I only run one Mobius because I don't. I don't really know that Mobius is that great. I could okay so nah this deck is legit I mean he's probably gonna go into a rank 5 I just don't know what that rank 5 is gonna be okay Volcasaurus always a good card RIP Mobius I think this is original attack right uh ch -ch -ch. and uh, inflict damage equivalent to uh the destroy original attack okay so I take 24 all right that's fine long as he can't kill me, I don't really think that I care. Because usually Volcasaurus is one of those cards where you bring it out. Um, you you want to bring it out once you're going to like kill somebody. You know what I mean? Like if you're not if you're not gonna kill anybody, then oh he's going to attack. Okay. All right. So this twenty five. I have nine hundred. Let's take sixteen. But it's cool because we can just detach materials. Trent gives no Fs. Uh, apparently not. All right, I'm at 700, so I'll take 800. Okay, we're good. We're st we're still good. We're still good. What's he gonna do right now? Trent is the next $100 card. Sweet. He didn't have anything. All right, now I think it's time to try and drop the boomstick on this guy. Oh wait, we need to be able to get rid of this stupid miracle fertilizer. Just thought about that. Uh. This hand's kind of weird because I, I kind of want to use Dark Dust Spirit, but then, like, Dark Dust Spirit and Enemy Controller don't really work together because if I take one of his guys, it's just going to blow the field up anyways. All right, we'll just Tribute. Let's activate this effect right here. See what we can get. Let's blow up the field. I'm, I'm kind of afraid of Miracle Fertilizer. I'm not going to lie. <clears throat> All right, so we emptied the field out. I think now is when we when we need to just special summon uh, swap frogs as many times as possible. So let's go ahead and do that. He's beating you with wood. I mean he's I mean he was kind of laying the wood on me for a quick second there, but I'm pretty sure we can get this duel back in our favor. Uh, mainly just we're gonna try and continuous continuously summon Rodentoden over and over and over again. 
I'm going to try and go for game here. I don't know. Do I have Gaia in the extra? I think I do have one Gaia in my extra deck. I mean, I'm just trying to load my graveyard up with uh, as many fogs as possible. Or I don't run Gaia. Okay, that's new to me. Sometimes I, I don't even know what I do and what I don't have in my extra deck. All right, we'll go for Rodent Toten. And we'll go for another Rodent Toten. I think we're going to exceed both Rodent Totens to make uh, a Digustal Phoenix. Damn, I kind of wish that I had another Gachi Gachi, to be honest. Because <laughs> I think I might be able to win. I don't know if I can. Yeah, actually, I think I may have done goofed. I don't know if I can win now. Uh, Gachi is, or Digestal Phoenix is 3,000 plus 22. That's 52 plus the 10. Oh, no, wait. I think I, I think I can still win. I think I can. No, wait, wait, wait. I need 350 more. So what else is in What What's in here that's ranked 2 that has a lot of attack? Uh, damn, I don't think, yeah, I don't, wait, wait, oh, I can use this, okay, I can win, I can win, I can still win, for a second, I was like, if he has mirror force, then I'm gonna lose, that, like, that's, that's pretty obvious, if he has mirror force, I'm going to lose, that's not even up for debate, if he has, because I'm going, I'm clearly going all in, <laughs> okay, not, not swap frog, I'm trying to go for road and totem, if he has a mirror force, then I definitely lose, and actually, this should be back in the graveyard, I believe, I'm not even sure. All right, we'll go for this random card right here. And this should be enough damage on board to kill this guy. If he has Mirror Force, then fuck it. Like, why would he have a Mirror Force now? He hasn't shown us any defensive cards the entire game except Phoenix Chain. Like, everything else has been Call of the Haunted and Reckless Greeds. So, all right, we'll attack for 3,000, attack for 2,200. And if we can get this last attack through, then that's definitely GG. Okay, he has... Oh, why wouldn't he have Oasis of the Dragon Souls, right? Like, okay, fuck it. We'll just... We were close to winning. All right, well, whatever. Uh, We'll just pass. I'm trying to think if I should set this... I'm going to set this enemy controller because in case things go bad, I, I have a way out. Bounce this to my hand. Probably going to need to use the enemy controller during my turn. <clears throat> he'll probably use Miracle Fertilizer, but he can't draw. So even if he summons an XC, I can just what's it called? I should play Yugi uh Nugio? Nah, dog. I mean Nugio means that I'm playing in GOAT format. GOAT format was so slow, man. Seriously. Because even though they had a lot of cards that did piercing damage, um, like Air Knight Pear Shaft, and uh I'm actually struggling to think of another one, to be honest. But well, I guess there was Spear Dragon, but I don't think anybody played that crap. Uh, even though, even though like Air Knight Parashaft was really big back then, and there was other things like a Sora Priest to get rid of uh, scapegoats, it just takes forever, man. Like, you know what I mean? Like, uh, those were definitely long duels. Trent is making a comeback. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, I don't know about that. Don't don't bet your don't bet your life on Trent making a comeback. I mean, it it might eventually, but don't bet your life on it. All right, he should be able to use Miracle Fertilizer. I don't really know where he's going to go from there. He's playing so much kind of like random stuff. It's still fun. You mean Go Format or Trent? It's faster than Goat Format from what I know. What format are you talking about, Sun's World? Because I'm not sure that I saw what format that you're talking about. Dude, he has another Infernal Reckless Summoning. Are you serious? Oh my god. This is like troll. <laughs> this is seriously like troll. This is Trent troll deck. Okay. He's not. No, he can't kill me with Valkasaurus because I have, I have enemy controller. <laughs> I can um I can enemy controller his dude. I'm pretty sure that's what I'm going to have to do. Put this on YouTube. <laughs> oh, my goodness. The Trent FTK. <laughs> seriously, it's just multiple Trents, man. I, this is so weird. I think this might go on YouTube, though, because this this is like some crazy shit that I would never think that anybody. Whoa, he's going with a rake five that requires three monsters. What the hell is he going for? OK, hold on one sec. <laughs> I wait, 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 wait. I got to read this. I have to read this. This is um, this is silent honor or dark uh, three rank or three level fives. 
Once per turn, it's ignition. Once per turn, I think you can target a special summon monster and like you absorb it or some shit like that. Uh, when this card is destroyed and sent to the graveyard while it has exceeds, you can special summon this card. Ah, uh, this is gonna be a bitch. Um, can he kill me with it? Cause if he can't kill me, then I like I might want to econ it during my next turn. Like I, I'm trying to think if he can kill me. I think it'd be better to just let him to let him take it. Uh, yeah, it takes a it takes a special monster, a special summon monster, and attaches it. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna give it to him, but reluctantly, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it to him. Go ahead, you can have it. Uh, you don't get my materials though, <laughs> but you get the monster. That's fine. All right, he gets it. That <laughs> Trent OTK. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. It's perfectly fine. I have Rodent Toad, and I can I can probably kill that thing during my next turn. Activates another Miracle Fertilizer. Fuck. <laughs> For Jerry Beats, man. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah, that deserves a clap. All right, all right. Oh, boy. Okay, here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do. Now we do have to take it. <laughs> Now we have to take that card. I know that I'm fine, but I didn't expect him. I kind of wanted to kill it. I kind of wanted to kill it. I need to take that. <laughs> no, all right. He's just going to end turn. All right. All right. All right. We have another Dark Death Spirit because apparently having one was like too much or having one was not enough. Um, I guess we'll bring out Treeborn Frog. I don't really know if there's a point. Uh okay he wants to go back okay that that's fine I'll let him go back if he wants to set something or something like that then I'll let him all right he wants to set the last card okay we'll go ahead and we'll get Treeborn Frog out I think I've kind of ran through all of my all of my good cards <clears throat> all right so I'm gonna storm forth that I believe when it goes to the graveyard with materials it comes back so. I don't know if that that yeah I guess that'll be afterwards, but we'll go ahead and we'll use Dark Dust Spirit. Goodbye, Treeborn Frog. It was kind of real. I, is he? I guess he's not gonna bring it back. Okay, well whatever. I'll just attack for game. Let's see if I can go ahead and uh, win. Call of the Haunted, really? Oh, the troll. The, oh, are you serious? Fuck this guy. All right. <laughs> okay. Well, hold on. I'm pretty sure I have another rank two that i can stall with it never had 101 as material. oh that's only when it has 101 okay okay fair enough now i'm trying to look and see if there's another rank two that i can stall with actually i don't technically think that i need a rank two i'm just gonna i'm just gonna start with the rodent totems i hate to do this but i'm just gonna stall with my rodent totems <laughs> this is really douche this is really scummy of me but i think that leaving the rodent totems out there by themselves is like a better play and if he top decks for Geki, the stream is over. So, cannot go. Yeah, I can't. Okay, that's right. I can't go into the extra anyway. But I can just sit on the Rodent Totems. I can just stall with them. Fuck, he still has Miracle Fertilizer. Oh, crap. Crappity, crap, crap, crap. He still has Miracle Fertilizer. Crap, crap, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Crap, 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 crap. I totally forgot he still has those stupid Miracle Fertilizers. All right, well, yeah. Okay, um, yeah, Trent, Trent's OP, dude. Trent is OP. Uh, I mean, I'm pretty sure it, as long as he has another, like, decent XC, he'll probably be able to get over. Uh, okay. He'll probably be able to, what's it called, to get over my, um, my Silent Honor arc. I mean, if he plays, like, double Volcosaurus anyway. Let's see if he has more Trent's. <laughs> double Fertilizer. <laughs> Oh, for double Trent. <laughs> okay. Oh, yep. Yeah. That's game. That's that's game. He didn't even he didn't even need both Trents. <laughs> GG. Trent is the best confirmed deck ever. Did he use Miracle Fertilizer? He did. Well, he used it now. Did the <laughs> Trent obliterate <laughs> Miracle Fertilizer? It it doesn't go to the graveyard. Um, if what's it called? No, I don't. I don't accept your draw offer. I admit defeat. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I have to tell this guy, nice deck. 
But anyway, yes, this this will definitely go on YouTube. <laughs>